We have another brother because unfortunately far too many Muslims fall, this, fall for this idea, this lie, this propaganda that somehow, somewhere we are terrorists, that we are planning to do something sometime. There are far too many innocent people who are suffering because of this propaganda and these lies. We have another brother, and we are privileged to have him today. Another victim of the war of terror, Wazem Beg, who will address us, inshallah. Allah <laughs> Akbar! Alhamdulillah, wa salatu wa salama ala rasulillah, wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa man wala. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. I was asked to speak about how I'm coping with my return after being nearly 20 months in solitary confinement, isolated from all the brothers of Guantanamo, and a complete of three years. Wallahi alazim, I swear by Allah, there's not one day in fact, not one hour that goes by, except that I think of the brothers that are still held there, particularly the British residents whom I knew, several of Shakir Amr, Jamil al-Banna, Bishr al-Rawi, Jamal Abdullah, and Umar Tigayas. There is not one second that I don't think and pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in my heart that Allah secures their early release. And whilst I was held, in Guantanamo, in solitary confinement, I wrote this poem. And it's, it is with that and with them in mind that I will now recite it, inshallah. The pursuits of men are in disrepute and the quest for wealth demands an encore. But the dominant sort is so absolute that excuses are conjured and declared as a war. The region of conflict is centered in Asia, home of black gold, birthplace of man. Confronting a barrier requiring er erasure, onward they press and battle Islam. So combat is waged against a religion, provoking a spate of ignorant rancor. But when observed from a neutral position, the state is prepared to settle a score. Repeating itself, just like the Crusades, history bears witness to sacred aggression. For those in denial, the memory fades, whilst freedom's champions wreak murderous session. The method's not new, just time and place, the savage renamed without reservation. Just follow footsteps, but when you retrace, inquire what became of the Indian nation. Or recall, if you will, in past century, Africa's children imported by wave. What do you courtesy, land of the free, that ensured liberty except for the slave? If armies are stationed, as we are told, throughout the world in pursuance of peace, then what has fashioned this new stranglehold when missiles are held with violent increase? Attacks from the air on September 11 kindled once more sweet vengeance's flame. Never forgotten or ever forgiven, those uninvolved must carry the blame. Like prisoners of conscience raised to new heights, few are made present by merit alone. Confined to a cage, deprived any rights, laws in written and oppression condoned. Years have elapsed in dull isolation, yet who dares admit the compounded error? The will has collapsed from tear desolation, the result shall emit with unbounded terror. Hilts of the dagger struck five inches deep, protrude from our backs, I fear to confess. But as ye have sown, so shall you reap. Retracting an inch, they call it progress. Jazakallah khair wa salam alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Jazakallah As the brother said, we should not forget that there are still people